Hello, everybody. Welcome back. I'm Alex. This is Josh. We are the target audience where content is made for absolutely everybody, but we think it's specifically made for us and hopefully for you guys as well. Today, we're finishing it. It's over. I feel like it just began. And now it's done. Zach Stone is going to be famous the last three episodes of this one-off season. I'm kind of sad about it because as soon as you get invested, they just pull the rug out from under you and it's over. But I hope it's good because these last three episodes we watched last time was uh, very enjoyable in terms of character development. Zach and Amy getting together. Comedy was at an all-time high with the Haunted House. That was... <laughs> I was dying. <laughs> baseball players beware. <laughs> like, you texted me the other day. In all caps, baseball players beware. And I just started busting out. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, what are your feelings going into this? Yeah, speaking of that episode, uh, I rewatched the part with the baby's crib just over and over laughing so hard um <laughs> all of our reactions to the, sh- the first nine episodes of the show are up right now you can go check them out if you missed any of them but yeah i, I you know kind of replicate your sentiment here i'm i'm really sad that this is the end i'm excited to see these last three episodes but it, once it's over you know we can never watch it for the first time again and that's just one of those you know one of those bummers but hey we got to experience this together and with everyone here watching with us we've had Plenty of comments of people really enjoying our watch along, and I do appreciate that. So if you're new here, subscribe to the channel. We watch shows like this. We also are watching The Book of Boba Fett and Clone Wars. We're watching Peacemaker on HBO Max. We react to movie trailers, um, you know, review movies sometimes. We'll be watching Moon Knight, you know, once that comes out. So subscribe so you too can become part of the target audience. Um, but yes, um, we're on episode 10 here. Zach Stone is going to be an actor. Uh, that's one that you would have thought would have been one of the first ones, but uh, here we go on episode 10, so are you ready to get going? Absolutely, let's do this. Must be these perfect eggs made by my perfect mother. Oh, well thank you, sweetie. Today, my mom's making me eggs, and just 18 years ago, my mom was making me out of one of her eggs. <laughs> oh. oh! Just eat your breakfast, Zach. Getting giddy over the idea of setting my car on fire? No, he kissed Amy last night. Dude! What? Oh my gosh, Zach! <laughs> Oh, are you two together now? No, I don't know. I don't want to talk about it. It was just the three of us, you know? Me, her, and the moment. Pitter-patter of rain against the window. <laughs> it wasn't raining. <laughs> you liked Amy this whole time? Yeah. I I could be a movie star. Are you... Well, I mean, it's a small <gasps> student-produced film. This is perfect! <laughs> Zach Stone is gonna be an actor, Zach. It's interesting because actors are the most famous people of all time other than – no, they are. And the fact that it took 10 episodes for him to come up with an actor is kind of funny. Yeah. Zach Stone. Zach Stone. <laughs> so are you and Amy together now? Uh, not really. Not really? Yeah, not really. So she's not going out with Nick either. No, no, she is oh technically, but not really. Well, she, she and her mother left for Maine this morning. So, I know you don't get service in Maine, so I'm just leaving you this message. Um, had a lot of fun last night. Really enjoyed that kiss at the end. Hope you did too. Oh, man. Okay, so these two characters, you know, they had sex the night before, and now this is the awkward breakfast at a diner the next morning. Oh, very Got fitting. It. This was also one of the IT guys from the office. Your eggs are getting cold. I know. I like them that way. Are you sure? Yep. I'm just going to mind. <laughs> oh, no, no, you, you don't mind. No, because I feel. You feel what? What? I feel so. You know the lines, man. Scramble. We we've seen what we need to see. Thank you. I feel like they're gonna give him the part though. Since COVID, I haven't done like an in-person audition. I feel like I'd fucking die if I tried. They've all been self-tapes. I mean, I practice auditioning for a class, and it's like you do all this work, and then you're up there, and you're like, <gasps> you know, it's just. Hey, Zach. Oh hey, no. Hey, hey man. Uh, uh, Amy and I broke up. Ooh. Not sure. Woo! Well, you know, I didn't plan on kissing. You her. fucking oh. dick happened. You know, I wasn't. Oh! Like, oh, I can't wait to break Nick and Amy up. You know, but. Why would you say that? You didn't know. Look, I'm <laughs> Nick, Nicholas. Nick, let's be adults about this, okay? <laughs> okay. <sighs> you need to get out of here, or I'm gonna call the police, okay? So I'm working at the grocery store, minding my own business, and then all of a sudden, I defeated <laughs> my mortal enemy in the name of love. <laughs> he didn't touch him. I just got that part in the movie. 
I'm gonna hey. be a badass, and I'm in love. Zach Stone. <laughs> nice third grade Valentine decorations, bro. Nice pose in the doorway, tool. Say hi to the rest of the <laughs> cast of Seven Heaven. <laughs> If I can channel my love for Amy into this scene, the public will find He's going to, like, change it up. They're not going to like it because they're going to like how he felt originally. Uh, oh, no. Your eggs are getting cold. I know. I like them that way. <laughs> oh, my God. And action. Your eggs are getting cold. You're a wonderful woman, okay? If nothing happens here, I feel like you just have just doesn't you. even go on the script. <laughs> <laughs> This is so painful. I want you to do it like you did in the audition. You know, you were so angsty and distant and confused. You know, that was that was perfect. Time, everybody. Okay, extras in position. Sound. Oh my God. Speed limit. Okay. And, and action. Oh God. I can't watch this. I can't. This is. Your eggs are getting cold. What are you doing? It's a uh, romantic. It's more romantic. Trust me. Women love wet men. So the film kids give me another shot tomorrow. I guess I'll wow. channel later. <laughs> Shocking. Like, you're telling me no one else auditioned? Like, you'd be <laughs> fucking off that set. Like, Oh, this is not going to go well. No, it's not. No. But then he'll be good enough for the role. My heart's pounding like crazy. It's, oh, my God. Let me say so much. You sure heard me talking about you. I was like, blah, blah, Amy's. <laughs> Kiss number two. Zach, we need to talk. About, uh, about what? I think what happened the other night was a mistake. Oh, get the fuck out of here. Okay, I'm gonna go. I think I'm gonna go now. Wait, please don't be angry with me. Well, I am. You should have known you just hook up with guys now. You don't give oh, it. Oh, God. But you should have known that I'm not like that. It just happened, okay? I'm sorry. This is all my fault. Yeah, it is. Are you, like, getting ready to go to college and be a slut? Oh, my God, dude. Tons of guys there. You're gonna love it. Jesus Christ. Ugh. It's like... He deserves to be upset, but it's like, why do you have to take it to that level? It's like, you didn't need to do that. Oh my god. Your eggs are getting cold. I know. I like them that way. Shut up and eat your food. Oh my god. Cut, 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 cut. <laughs> um, you had a good start. Okay. Listen, Zach, really appreciate the large adjustments you've made since yesterday. <laughs> just trying to split the difference, okay? Because I'm the director. Oh, really? Because you just seem like a dumb kid with a film crew. <laughs> Zach, calm down. Calm down? Won't it calm down? How about we just all calm down, huh? Zach, you're fired. Good call. He <laughs> said <that> good call. <laughs> <laughs> I really like you. Like, more than anybody. I lashed out because I think I probably know deep down that I'm, I'm not boyfriend material. Zach, it's not because of that. Time. Yeah. Still best friends? Oh, yeah. Of course. Mm. <laughs> friends that kissed once. Yeah. Ouch. Yeah. I'm sorry things didn't work out between you and Amy, honey. No, it's fine. We're, we're still friends. Why do you think? Do you think it's going to be weird? And they're doing the, the, the awkward scene. Just as friends. In real you don't have to say just as friends. Honey, I forgot to ask you. How would you like your eggs? Ha 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 You know the thing like in dreams where like you try to run, but you can't, you know, because of your dream legs? That was happening. And I'm running after this light. And this mob of people is running after me. This is the O of the Hollywood sign. And the beginning of a dream. <laughs> like, if I were Zach's brother, I wouldn't leave my room at all. Because <laughs> you, you know you're going to be exposed to this fucking bullshit all day long. <laughs> and I heard them say that uh, they thought there were still kids up in the building. I heard about this online. Some apartment building in Saga's caught on fire and he saved two kids. And he, now he's... And everyone's been talking. I gotta go. Zach Stone is gonna be a hero. 
listen, I'm very behind in my packing. I started about two minutes ago. I should have started about two months ago. I have the idea. Because I have the idea. You remember my friend, Greg? Yes, the older gentleman from your dinner party. I'm the, I'm the same age, but that, that's All fine. Right. <laughs> I, uh, I am promoting you. <laughs> you are hereby DeSantos' newest assistant manager. The quickest way to get famous is to become a hero. Captain Sully went from looking like a character on Guess Who to a magnet in one flight. Hey, Zach. Hey, Abe. Oh, no. Um, I'm having a little barbecue tomorrow. Kind of an end of the summer going off to college thing. Oh, yeah, she's leaving too. I used to spend all day in there. I'd pretend to wash paper plates while you pretended to read the newspaper. Yeah, it was pretty sexist. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get out of your hair. Oh, this is so awkward. You're out of money. What? Have you been checking your bank statements recently, or have you just been blindly writing checks to these guys? I had so much money when this started. You have $1,500 left. You, no, you're going to stop this, and you're going to save the $1,500. No, 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 no. Dad, you... Dad, I have the idea. The idea. I'm going to be famous. Zach, when you go broke next week, we won't be bailing you out. Great. I won't need it. Help me. Help me. Hold on there, partner. I'll save you. <laughs> USA! USA! Yeah! <laughs> America. Great. Let's take it again. Perfect. Just no. reset. Dry you off. No. What are you dry, dry you off. You swallowed a lot of water, okay? I think you're not thinking correctly. No, you're being a d again. Has he finally realized the ridiculousness of this whole situation? So Amy's going to Brown next year. Yeah, it's pretty cool, Amy's uncle. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you going? Straight to the top. Oh. Remember. Guys, like I don't, I don't know what you want me to do right now. I just, I've just been thinking it might be better if we didn't talk for a while. Gotta cut it off clean. <laughs> These are my last normal steps. The finish line to fame is right hey! there. Hey, he is gonna submit something. Yeah, it's fucking tape saving his break. <laughs> <laughs> none of the <laughs> none of the other stuff. And I bet it's not edited well at all. Yeah. Or edited at all. What are those cameras for? Oh, uh, I'm a pre-celebrity, so they're documenting my rise to fame. Why are they doing that? Because I hired them. Two. My god, he actually One. got in. I'd like Jesus to Christ. Myself for a hero story, please. Uh heroes don't usually submit themselves. I know it's uh it's pretty brave of me. <laughs> <laughs> They like to pretend like they're hard to impress, but once they see that DVD. Oh. Uh. Oh, dude, this is my, this is my time castle from middle school. I thought I buried this thing. This is my retainer. I had this for two years, never really quite fit. So I found it in the back of the bus. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Pack all my stuff? Yeah, just a little thanks for uh, all the good work you've done for the wow. show. Hope you packed his hentai. <laughs> Even though I know it can happen in the future still, it's just weird to realize that it's not going to happen anytime soon. Yeah, all right, I should go. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, I'll get that. Hi. Yeah, we'd like to get some footage for a story we're doing. What's the story about? <laughs> you. <laughs> Zach Stone is just a week ago. He had no money, no hope. He had a brother that looked like a poor man's Andrew Garfield. No one <laughs> believed in him. I, Zach Stone, am being profiled by WHBH Boston, Channel 4. Does anyone hear that? Is that a theme song? No, 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 no. no, no, no. Please. Please. One, two, no. three, four. Zach Stone is gonna be famous. No, really, he's gonna be famous. Oh, it's all the same clips from the first one. Talk to you for a second. Yeah. Guys, keep keep put the camera down. Just... Oh, did he quit? Hey. You, guess, uh, all uh, right, go leave. Oh, there's a lot of callbacks to the first episode. I, I I know that you said we can't be friends. I can't either. Yeah, you're leaving tomorrow. You're leaving. You don't have to answer now. Just think about it. Okay. 
You're worried that I'm going to embarrass you? Yeah, just calm down, no, okay? No, listen to me. You never listen to me. Do you know Mom had to convince me to be on this stupid news show? She had to beg me until I said yes, and you're worried I'm not good enough to be Zach Stone's brother? I'm embarrassed to be your brother. The five minute profile, Zach. It's exposure, okay? This is how the business works, Dad. You gotta be the king of queens before you're Paul Blart. <laughs> <laughs> well, if the couch is too expensive, I can get a paper route and pitch in, Daddy. Uh, brother, the adults are talking, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I'm Zach Stone, and this is my family. Oh, my God. Great. Let's begin. Oh, my God. So, Mr. and Mrs. Stone, when did you first realize that Zach wanted to be famous? Uh, Zach always wanted to be famous. Uh, oh. I'm sorry. Are you reading your answers off an index card? <clears throat> <laughs> okay, Papa, you want to build another birdhouse together? We've never built a birdhouse together. <laughs> Think about all the stuff I did this summer. Any other parent would have thrown me out of the house. Not this guy, though. He stuck with me and supported me. I need to leave. This kid has actually convinced us to let another camera crew into our home. That's true. This is a big opportunity. <laughs> Honey, this has got to stop. This is just one more day of this. But we have got to stop doing what's best for Zach and start doing what's best for all of us. Let's go. you see yourself in 10 years? Hollywood, dead parents. Oh my God. Well, that sounds like being famous is a 24 seven job for you. How does that affect your relationships with other people? I just want to do it alone. I just want to be famous. Hi, Miss Paige. Uh, Hi. Is, is Amy home? She left for school, Zach. Oh. 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 Nice one, please. But you always supported me, Greg. Usually against your will. I really appreciate it. It's not a problem, you know. We have fun together. Last sleepover at Greg's house. Last, Last sleepover, sleepover at Greg's house. house. So, how much time do I have? Three minutes. Dang, he's like gonna be Three on minutes. the live yes, show. The video segment is one minute, and your interview is two minutes. Two minutes? God. It's the magic routine. Right out the window. <laughs> Do a magic routine. The Stones are your classic all-American family. <laughs> but their eldest son, Zach, wants the new American dream. Fortunately, he has a lot of support from his loved ones. Zach and I don't always see eye to eye. And he's definitely a bit of a character. But more importantly, he has character. Zach knows what he wants, and he won't let anything stand in his way. Zach wants the world to love him as much as he loves the world. If he's half a good a celebrity as he is a son and a brother and a friend, he'll be fine. Having Zach as a brother is pretty interesting. <laughs> but I've it. known for a while. <laughs> they have the other brother for all the other B roll say. footage. <laughs> That's my bro. It's like he's not in any of it when it's like this is his family. <laughs> Zach is one in a million. I've never met anyone Maybe like him. Work. As a special treat, we asked Zach Stone to make his first ever live appearance here at WHBH. That segment, they just showed it. It didn't show what my life's like. My, my house is usually a mess. My family is usually fighting. Point is, it's like that because of me. And despite all that, they said, said all that really nice stuff about me. And that's really awesome. That's awesome. They're the best. And I love, I love them so much. Okay, let's... And that short hair blonde girl at the end, that's... That's not just any short haired blonde girl at the end. See, I always thought like that this moment would be like the most important moment of my life. But I'm here, and she's somewhere else, and that's all I can think about. And I'm in love with her. <sighs> I'm gonna go talk to her. Bring it in. Come on. <laughs> <sighs> well, I guess the old, uh... Amy? Amy, Mm. Yes. Oh my God. Zach Stone doesn't need to be famous. Zach Stone just needs to be Amy's. Well, are, are we boyfriend and girlfriend? Sure. Well, yeah. are we? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Ah. <sighs> so this is it. The last shot. There he is. Are you two together now? <laughs> <laughs> you guys look so cute together. Hey, Zach Stone. 
Can I have your autograph? Blackstone is gonna be famous. Blackstone is gonna be famous. No, 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 no. Stone is famous. Blackstone is famous. Wow. Oh. So much to talk about. Oh my god. How, how do we even. Holy shit. How do we even break this down? I'll, I'll I'll start just by saying that I felt that I was worried like about halfway through the episode after he had the argument with his brother and like certain things happen. I was like, I, I hope that they don't leave a bunch of like loose threads that aren't resolved, you know, that they can never get to. But I think with the video package at the end uh, and then like the sleepover with Greg's the video package at the end and then the ending with Amy um, before they go outside, it kind of. Re gave a resolution to every character you know maybe not a full resolution with everything solved but you know some type of resolution you know it really did leave it to where if it was the end of the show which it ended up being you know everything was resolved while still leaving the door cracked open for the future which unfortunately ended up not coming but you know I think that I'm just glad it didn't end in such like an open-ended way where you have no idea what's going on with everybody. Uh, I think they purposefully probably did that because they didn't know if it was going to continue or not. Yeah. Uh, yeah, man. They, they fucking killed it. That ending where he, like, he finally has his chance to be famous. He has his platform, and all he can think about is his friends and his family and Amy who have put up with all of his bullshit. And still supported him. And it's like, that moment was beautiful. And it was really nice, because he gets Amy. And then, like, at the very end, he does become famous, but then Amy starts to turn. It's like, no! It's like, they should have just ended it with, like, the paparazzi. If we... Obviously, hindsight mm -hmm. being almost, you know, nine being nine years later. You, you look at it like, okay, they should have ended it if, if it was a one-off. But maybe mm -hmm. they didn't know if it was going to be a one-off. Um, but I still like the open endingness because it's true that, you know, even, even if, you know, the show never comes back, if these characters go on and live their lives, there's more struggles that are always going to come. You know what I mean? Whether he becomes mm -hmm. famous or not, they don't just get together and now everything in his life is solved. You could tell throughout the show, even though he grows as a person, he, Zach Stone is still a very flawed person. So even by the end, as he's growing and getting better, there's still going to be those challenges he faces with you know, with his family, his friends, his girlfriend, Amy, even if it's not becoming famous. But I think that little end part was a good way of showing that even though things are better, uh, if there had been a second season, you know, there still would have been a lot to explore as with, you know, everything in life. There's always going to be new challenges, even though you've achieved the goal that you want. There's just going to be a new set of challenges. So I enjoyed it. It was a little bit over the top at the end, like when she really turned that quickly of, <laughs> of her emotions like that quick. But, you know, it's it's to, you know, give you that cliffhanger ending a little bit. But, no, I really, really enjoyed it, especially that last five minutes or so. Yeah, man. I mean. I think we just told the story in our reactions. Really, it's like I don't think there's I don't think I can elaborate anymore to tell you the truth. It's just you know they told the story, man, and they uh, they told it well. Yeah. I'm, I, it sucks because I fucking hate getting attached to stuff that isn't fucking real. <laughs> it's like it's like why why it's like it's fake. I whatever it was real to me damn it. it was real to me damn it um and yeah and everyone like i said earlier that's been watching along with us has really enjoyed watching it with us and or watching our reactions after they've seen it so just want to thank everyone for uh watching with us i mean this isn't marvel it's not you know we're fans of bo burnham but it's not like this big uh you know show that we're watching but i feel like the reason it's gotten the response that it's gotten on our channel is because of you know the emotions that it has and the characters that it has in it it's definitely grown that fan base who knows if it ever does come back if it's something Bo's ever interested in I've heard rumors I've heard things of him making small comments here and there about you know possibly re-exploring it the odds are slim to none realistically um but yeah overall I think that I've really enjoyed watching it here on the channel, and if there are other things like this that you guys out there watching would want us to go back and react to, maybe not something that's brand new or going on right now, but we're open to, you know, any shows or things like this that we can go back and watch that, you know, we've missed. So definitely leave that down in the comments if you guys have any other ideas. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, for Netflix to pick it up how many years later, it's like, you know, never say never, you know, it's like, Toby and Andrew Garfield will never be in a, you know, it's like... <laughs> I, I don't like with the way things are it's like anything can fucking happen so please bring this show back but 
thank you all for watching what do you think wrap this up yeah sure so if this is your first time here or if you're not subscribed make sure to subscribe to the channel we are currently watching the book of boba fett and peacemaker every week we're watching star wars the clone wars and we also watch movies uh react to movie trailers review movies so subscribe so you can become part of the target audience absolutely thank you all for joining us on this great journey i'm alex this is josh we are the target audience where content is made for absolutely everybody but we think it's specifically made for us and hopefully for you guys as well thanks for coming along and we'll see you in the next one